What's up, WTF family, aka the Tabor Squad? So, listen, today I'm by myself. Well, I'm not by myself. Jamie Lynn is in the building. Say hi, Jamie Lynn. Just say hi. She passed me her cup. Okay, so today I have the frog legs that I showed you. Um, and I also have some homemade french fries. And I'm going to eat my daddy's uh, pickled tomatoes, too. A couple of those. And I have my condiments on the side. Um, so let's go. I can get to pray today on, 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 on the camera. Because Mr. Tabor is not here. So I get to pray on the camera. Bye your heads, everybody. Lord, thank you for this food that we are about to receive. Bless the hands that prepared the food from start to finish. Lord, let this food be nourishment for our bodies. Let it be flavorful and very tasteful to our taste buds. Lord, I just want to thank you for my YouTube family. Thank you for those that watch our videos, that take the time out of their busy schedules to sit down and watch the table family in action. Lord, bless all of our channels. Let all of our channels blossom more than we could ever imagine. Lord, I thank you right now for that, and I claim it in the name of Jesus. Lord, thank you for everything that you have done for me and my family. Lord, I just want to thank you and give you all the praises. These and all other blessings, I thank you in your son Jesus' name. Amen, amen, and amen again. Good bread, good meat, good Lord, let's eat. Okay. So let's just get it in, y'all. So this is ranch, just regular ranch. I do have um, the powder ranch that I make myself, but I didn't have time to do any of that. I just grabbed what I had in the cupboard. Mm. Sure got some napkin. So y'all, let me just um, say this. I want to thank everybody. What you want, baby? Oh, you want to dip? Go ahead and dip. Dip your fry. Dip. When you dip, you got to get it back out. Here you go, boo. So I want to thank everybody that took the time to, um, that, that, that listened to my request on Sunday, that took the time to pray for me. And I was in such, okay, let me just give you the backstory. Brandon had a small procedure that he had to have done on uh, Tuesday the 21st. So we decided to just make an entire weekend of the whole trip. The uh, place that we had to go was like three hours away. So can I eat while I'm talking? Because my food getting cold. So we just decided to go um, a couple of days ahead of time. And this is salt and vinegar uh, shake right here. Oof. So I had already go we, well, we had went to the place once before for his consultation. So I had Googled all the little eatery places and places to shop. So I had made up in my mind that we were going to do some shopping while we were there, right? So on the way there, we took the Jeep. I sat in the back with Jamie Lynn and my husband, like six foot tall, he had the seat all the way back and I just sat behind him. I don't know why I did that. Him being so tall and Brandon's tall. He's like five feet tall. So, um, I sat in the back with Jamie Lynn. I was fine. I had adequate leg room. I thought I was fine. So, we get to the hotel. Check in. Um, Go put our luggage in the room. When he got something to eat, went to Walmart. I know we're going to find Walmart. Went to Walmart, get some supplies for me to clean the room up and get some snacks or whatever. And I came back to the room and sat down in a chair and, you know, just going through our clothes and stuff. And when I tried to get up, I could, it was like I was like paralyzed. I stood up my back, like right here at the pit at the back bottom right here. I just, I, I don't know what happened. The pain was so severe and I just, I just screamed and I tried to sit back down, ease myself back down and that made it even worse. And I said, well, let me try to stand up. So I was telling everybody, I said, y'all, I can't, I can't, I can't move. I need some help. So Brandon's on one arm, my husband's on the other arm and they literally had to help me stand up and I, I, I couldn't 
I could walk, but it's like I was slumped over. Like, you know, I said, let me just try to lay down to try to, you know, take some pressure off of my back. So laid in the bed a little while. And, you know, you always supposed to follow your first mind. Your first mind, they say, is the Holy Spirit anyway, right? So before we left, I grabbed the uh, extra strength Tylenol off of the uh, the table. I said, let me grab this because I might always got a headache or something. So I grabbed it, not knowing that I was, I, while I was grabbing it, you know. So that was the first thing I thought about. I said, where is the, uh, the Tylenol? So they looked through the bags and found it. And I took two. Laid there for a while thinking, if, okay, let me get a nap in. And by the time I, you know, wake up from the nap, I'll be fine. So I couldn't really rest. I, you want a french fry, baby? Here you go. I couldn't really rest, so I was like, I know I didn't get down here away from home to get sick. And I didn't want to go to the ER. Stop, boo. I didn't want to go to the ER because I didn't want to be stuck down there, you know, in the hospital. Can y'all still see my food? I had a call come through. So anyway, uh, let me put the tape back. Ooh, you got some of that salt and vinegar, did you? Long story short, I said, let me call on some people to pray for me. We all know the prayers of the righteous availing much, so... I said, let me get some, some real prayer warriors on this, you know. I laid down. And, you know, a lot of people say you can't find genuine people on YouTube. That may, you know, you don't know what people's intentions are. But I think there are genuine people everywhere you go. And so I got a text message. From someone I met on YouTube. Never met her in person. Talked to her on the phone. No. From time to time. And <clears throat> I'm talking about Mama T, y'all. She was checking on me to see how I was doing. And when I explained to her what was going on, you know, she told me what it could be and explained to me, you know from an experience that she had and i was like this sounds just like what i got and when i thought about it every time i go for my yearly or just if i have to make a doctor's visit <clears throat> i always make sure they check my potassium level because i all i have suffered with cramps for years for years and so my friend told me she said drink pure coconut water that'll get rid of those cramps and so I have been drinking coconut water. When I'm on the coconut water, I only drink eight ounces a day. And I had stopped because the cramps had went away. And I'm like, okay, so maybe I had to take it for, you know, a little while. I can lay off it a little while. So I went on the coconut water. But we had just bought some recently. So, um, and I didn't even bring it with me. So now that I was thinking, I said, well, maybe all these years, because every time I got my potassium check, when I went to the doctor, it was always fine. It was always fine. So I was trying to figure out where could the cramps be coming from? And so now when uh, Mama T was telling me about that, I said, you know what? And the pain that I had, it, it went down to my upper thighs. I said, that could have been that uh, sciatic nerve all the time, because I never had that check. And so... um. I just, I just, the whole trip, we went there for Brandon, but the trip was like, I couldn't do no shopping, couldn't do nothing. And I took medication and that eased the pain some for just to manage it, but it never went away. And so I made a doctor's appointment to go, you know, and so I can get diagnosed or whatever to see what the problem is. But I'm pretty sure that's what it is. But I want to thank everybody for praying for me. They took time to answer my request. There were 31 people that uh, responded to my for my that responded to my cry. I call it a cry because I was crying out for some help. 31 people responded, and those people, somebody was really praying because I felt much better. I felt better than I did, you know. I don't know how long it takes me to call 31 names, but I want to thank everybody that responded to my cry. And of those 31 people, 
I'm going to put all of your names. I already written them down. I'm good, going to put all of your names in a drawing. And uh, I don't know if I'm going to send you T-shirts or some of the uh, seasons that we make. But I'm going to do something because y'all could have just scrolled like a lot of other people did. You could have just scrolled on by, but you didn't. You actually took time and thought about me. So I really appreciate you all for that. Now let's talk about these frog legs. <laughs> Stop, Jamie Lynn. Okay. So I was asking my mom. I said, Mom, what do you call it when you go looking for frogs? Let me see if I can remember what she said. She said gigging, I think. Gigging? Because I was saying dish digging, but she said, I'm pretty sure she said gigging. So, no, I didn't go gigging for these. I bought these in the grocery store. And y'all eat seafood. Y'all eat crawfish, crab legs, <laughs> shrimp. Why y'all eat frog legs? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I don't eat seafood. Well, my husband and my son love it. I can't eat it because I'm allergic to it. But I was thinking, I said, people suck on crawfish heads. They suck the uh, crab leg. Eat the shrimp. But you don't want to eat frog leg. Why? Why, y'all? Why y'all don't want no frog leg? Try them. Y'all may like them. What, baby? They may like them, huh? Yeah. Y'all might like them. Yeah, good for me. But, uh... <clears throat> mm-hmm. Y'all, I appreciate y'all so much for sticking with us. And we go live. I'm just getting kidding. Maybe I need to move. Y'all come in and hang out with us for a few minutes. And Mr. Tabby is excited. He come in from work. It's a nice Friday night now. What we need to get ready. Well, I'm glad. Because we had to start doing YouTube. For a number of reasons. But I've been enjoying it since we've been back. <clears throat> I want to do some collabs with somebody. Whether if it's cooking. Or arts and crafts. Y'all know I'm arts and craft, crafts queen. Or something. Let's find something to collab on. Collab collaborate on. <laughs> I'm using some sriracha on this and it's piping hot. I was going to use my own hot sauce, but <clears throat> I couldn't find it. Brandon could have taken it to school with him. I don't know. And I didn't even have time and didn't feel like making them. You know, give me your cup, Jamie. Yeah, boo. So I just wanted to stop by and show y'all that the, I'm still alive. The frog legs didn't, didn't kill me. And thank y'all for praying for me. And then some of y'all, after you left a comment, saying you were going to pray, some of y'all came back and asked how I was doing, you know, afterward. That meant a lot to me. And you know, when people don't know you and they say they're genuine, that go a long way. <laughs> well, I didn't get to do no shopping, but that's all right. Hey, I go back um on the 20 something. You got to go back um once a month. For six months. 
Mm. Y'all, these frog legs are so good. I wouldn't tell you nothing wrong now. <laughs> There's some sweet chili sauce. If it wasn't good, I'd tell you. Ooh, it's hot though. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm still making my rounds so everybody chill. <clears throat> Oh, let me say this, family. Table squad. <laughs> if you drop a video today, and I don't get to your video today, please don't count me out or chop my head off. Or even the next day. Okay, let's 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 say today's fr well with today, let's say today's Friday. If you drop a video on Friday or a premiere on Friday, <clears throat> And I don't get to your premiere or your, your video until Sunday or Monday. Please don't count me out. Know that I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm com I promise you I'm coming. Because I want to support you. And let me tell you what's going on. I'm back in school get my master's. I have a 16-month-old toddler. That, uh, I'm 42. <laughs> and I got a 16-month-old toddler. So, you you fill in the middle part, okay? So, I'm with Jamie Lynn, and then we have a business that, you know, I run on the side, you know? In our business, uh, we do t-shirts, we cater, decorate for parties, we do the seasonings, you know? So, it's I'm always, all throughout the day, I'm so busy. I am so, 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 so busy. But just know that I'm coming. I promise you that I'm coming. If it's two or three days, I'm coming. And when I watch my videos, well, your videos, family, what I like to do when I when the video first starts, I why I say, well, I'm here watching, you know, or something like that. And as the video goes on, if I see something, I say, well, you that was funny you did that. I mean, throughout the video, I'm sitting there making comments. You know, because it's funny. You know, I'll wait to the end of the video and then just sum it all up. I like to chop it up and, you know, into intervals and say, oh, I like that. Whatever you did right there, like that. That's what I do. And then sometimes with your playlist, oh, I was touched so, it's something warm my heart so well the other day. I can't think of her name, but on the next video, I'm, I'm remember to look what her name was. She said, I'm a new subscriber. She said, I'm going to watch your playlist and get caught up because I like your family. Whoever that young lady is, I got to send her something because nobody ever told me they was going to watch my playlist. Never. Ever. And I could tell she had been watching because she went back and, 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 and left comments and stuff. So I'm fine. I, I got to go back and look and see who she is. But just know I'm gonna get caught up on y'all video. I'm gonna watch them because when I um laying in bed some night, when I put Jamie Lee in the bed, and that first time I lay down, it's like, whew. and I watch videos throughout the night. It's two or three o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna watch them. I'm telling y'all, that's what I do. My husband turned over. You love that YouTube, don't you? Okay, I'm just trying to pay some love back. I'm just trying to, you know. And I don't mind doing because y'all are funny as heck. I love it. I want to collab with some of y'all. But I'll reach out to you. Or you can reach out to me. It don't matter. Whatever you want to do. Y'all do not sleep on the frog legs. Do you hear me? Mmm. <laughs> mmm. 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 Mm. 
Don't forget to join us on Friday night for um for our Ring the Bell Jam Fest. And let me tell you where Ring the Bell came from. Uh, it was Mr. Tabor's <clears throat> birthday. I think it was 2018. Try these tomatoes. They should be ready now. And uh, we were at a Mexican restaurant. And <laughs> you know how you relax and enjoy yourself. And then how they bring the... Uh, I can't even open it. May not get trying today. <clears throat> so when they brought, you know how they bring the the the, the pie in the in the sombrero for you to wear. So they brought it to Mr. Tabor. He loved to dance. He got up. He was feeling himself, y'all. You want to try one? You can have one. Hmm. Oh, he uh, you can get it. <clears throat> Is it good? Ooh, 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 ooh. Ain't like that lemon, is it? Mm hmm. Mm. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. He got him start dancing. I don't know where that came from. Ring the bell, baby. Ring the bell, baby. And my sister and her husband were with us. And she never forgot that every time we get together, she said, say, ring the bell, ring the bell. So that's where that came from. Okay. And don't forget to join us on our Jam Fest Friday night. Mm. You like it? Mm. You don't know yet? <laughs> That's it, y'all. Mm -hmm. It's good? <laughs> it's waiting. So that's it. See y'all Friday night. Love y'all. Thank y'all for thinking of me. Thank y'all for the shout outs that our channel has received. I really want to call you names because y'all didn't have to check on me. Let me go ahead. It's not going to take but a minute, so I didn't want to do a long video. <clears throat> <clears throat> y'all go check these people out their channel because these right here are some genuine people okay auntie a's kitchen let's bake and cook stuff demetrius jones logical one the fruits family <clears throat> patricia weathington 22 natasha estelle sam and cat the zam fam rome's eating and conversations Fayo Family, Praying Couple Cooking Series, Coco TTV, Stephanie's Crafts and Creation Rug, Mama T Speaks, Pooh and Ribs, Double Trouble Twins, Keeping Up with the Griffins, Meet the Lees, Mom of Twins 2, Yarami Gomez, Natalia TV, My Love DRM, For the Price Family, or Pride, yeah, Prize or Price, For the Price Family. Can't read my own writing. Remy Today, Cooking Series for Men, Technical Delip, Hoodie ASMR, Willow's Creations, Bong Tay Na KPTT. I don't know, y'all. I appreciate them. <laughs> and Patricia King. That's 31 people that took time out of their busy schedule. I know everybody got stuff that they're doing. Everybody's involved in a lot of stuff have their own families and family and private time. Thank you for thinking of me because I needed those prayers. Lord knows I did and continue to pray. You know, please pray without ceasing. Please pray, for, continue to pray. So that's it, y'all. Thank y'all. Love y'all. Meet us on Friday night. Oh, and you know what? I'm, I'm glad I thought about this. I looked up and saw, I looked through my, um, uh, my data. You all right, baby? And I see that 34% of people that watch our videos are not subscribed to our channel. Jamie Lynn. 
No, that is not here. 34% of the people that watch our videos are not subscribed to our channel. So, I'm asking you if you are watching this video, if you have watched our videos and like our channel, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the little bell to be notified so when we drop videos, you will know about them. <laughs> you will know about them. And when you subscribe to this channel, trust and believe we're going to come and show you some love right back over to your channel. If you have a channel, we're going to show you love and we're going to follow you, <clears throat> you know, and we get to know each other and, and just hang out. You know, uh, YouTube it, it's some pretty good people, at least in the community that we that we have right now, the community of, of creators that we have interacted with. They're pretty good, you know. So that's it, y'all. Meet us Friday night for Ring the Bell, Baby's Jam Fest. Love y'all. Peace. Say peace, Jamie Lynn. <laughs>